Hi, my name is Jason with Kinsey Manufacturing. Here at Kinsey, we realize that planting comes around once a year. So we produce the following video to help you to review essential operation of the 4900 electric drive planter using the Kinsey Virtual Terminal. To start 4900 planter, first thing we're gonna do is make sure our tractor is on and our virtual terminal is powered up. We're using a Viper 4 for this video, but the screen and operation will be the same no matter which virtual terminal you are using. On our startup page, we have three sections. The first section talks about which hydraulics we need to turn on in order to have the planner operational. The first one is our alternator remote, which is our black labeled hoses. After we turn our alternator on, we should have a green indicator light next to our alternator at the top. The second remote we need to turn on is our bulk fill fan. This remote not only controls our bulk fill fan, but also our fertilizer centrifugal pump if you have that option. That is our yellow labeled hoses plugged into the back of the tractor. The third option is our vacuum meters or vacuum fans. If it is all run off of the tractor, you have two separate remotes, one for the left fan, one for the right fan. They both need to be turned on at this time. If you are using a PTO pump, as it is noticed here, we must turn our PTO on on the tractor. The second section talks about settings that the planter is currently set to. This is the settings that the planter was left in in the last power cycle. As we can see, we have our crop type, our seed rate for both our right and left hand sides, our downforce if we have pneumatic downforce, our fertilizer rate if we're equipped with fertilizer, and our insecticide rates for right and left hand sides in pounds per acre. All of these options show no matter if your planter is equipped with them or not. We will change or go through changing these options in later videos. The third option or section talks about selecting continue and turning on the master switch to continue to plant. Once you press this continue button, this screen will go away until the next power cycle of the system. Once we press continue, we then are taken to our home page where we can turn on our master switch and start the planting process. Well, thank you for watching. We hope you found the video helpful. For more quick reference videos just like this one, make sure you go to Kinsey.com or to the Kinsey Manufacturing YouTube channel.